Yo, world, what is going on? What is going on, world? It is the Jason Weems Show, the number one Chase Your Dream Show. And today it is my first day at SUNY New Paltz. Um, S-U-N-Y, State, State University of New York, New Paltz, P-A-L-T-Z. Um, I am a theater major, Black Studies minor. Uh, that's, that's a whole nother video. But um, I'm just doing this quick, uh, you know, module thing um, for inclusion and diversity at my college, which I'm pretty, you know, fond in, but there's always something to learn. But today, uh, in probably about like 20 minutes, 30 minutes, I'm going to get dressed, bundle up, all that good stuff, hook up my tripod, and we're going to do a little campus tour. I ate breakfast, shout outs to, my, to Oiko's. And I had me a little grapes. I had to give me a little bottle of water to fill me. Um, we're going to get it popping. I'm going to see y'all soon. Peace. Y'all can hear me, but this is Shaolin Gunk. Oh, you pouts. That's our lounge area. This is actually a lot different from being a community college and whatnot. Corona came, changed everything, but you see the office is closed. Boom. Elevator. And we got it. It's lit. Let's go explore. Yo, guys, yo, guys, what is going on? What is going on? I'm back. This is my first time exploring outside on this campus. And it looks pretty, I guess, I don't know. Um, I don't really know what to say because I'm used to community college and your boys from the projects, New York City Housing Authority. So I don't know what to think and I don't know how I'm feeling about this. But just for your info, that's my hall right there. I'm looking at a rest halls right there, which is, I don't know the name of that hall. I don't know what this is. Um, and this is like one giant trail, like one super big trail. But um, on that note, I just think, you know, I, I moved in yesterday, you know, and just it's it's so much to see um so much to do things are pretty limited of course because of covid but i am all this shit is really new um i'm looking at a whole bunch of buildings that's just like i don't even know what's in there i know that i do have in-person classes and i do have things you know to do um, inside of those buildings, not everything is virtual. Uh, some of my classes are virtual, but not all of them. Um, shit is pretty, it's just all right, it's all right. Let's go, uh-huh. Here's our dining hall. How, uh, dining information here. I guess I can go in. I'm gonna do a little tour around camp before I go see what this is about. I really know what's in there like that. There's our basketball court that I had to drive past to go into my hall. I guess there's like spots for bikes and stuff. I guess it's like cool chill out spot. More res halls over there. Um, more res halls over there. Um, I don't really know this. I, you know, this, this is a cool area right here, I guess. To picnic and chill, talk crap, socialize. Link shorty at the class. That's all right. That's cool. It's parking and all that good stuff over there. I don't really know anybody here except for my RA. Um, and I live with homies, so <laughs> that's a plot to us. So here's something I always heard about coming to New Paltz, Um, is the pond. Yes, that is a pond, but it is frozen like a mug. And 
I'm gonna go check that out. I'm gonna definitely go check that out. So I guess it stretches from all the way over there, all the way over there. And um, we gonna see what that's about. Okay, that's VIP parking over there. I am not going over there. Join is frozen. This shit is frozen. That's crazy. Um, it is pretty cold outside. It is not New York City weather. Even though New York City is pretty cold itself. Um, shit is all right. Um, it's definitely a change in temp. Cool trees and shit like that. Another thing is too, most of my college um, is female. So I am straight. I like all types of shorties, but it's like a little cool walkway. I've been seeing a lot of girls, like a lot of them. And I'm just like, sheesh, but I ain't rushing into nothing because it could be a lot of drama and a lot of shit that I don't want to be a part of. Um, I'm here to do my work ultimately. Get shit done. But uh, so this pond is pretty long. It looks like it extends actually all the way over there from what I'm seeing. Um, there's another res hall building. I don't want to get in nobody's window. I don't know what they doing up there. Um, so student center is there. Um, come on, go check that out. So, it's real quiet. It's really, really quiet. Um, it's, I'm getting like city and country vibes from this camp. It's not too country and it's not too city. So I feel like I'm in New York City all over again. So it's pretty, it's, it's pretty cool. Edge on falls on feet. OG, Nike on the ass. You feel me? Calm gap jeans. I don't like to spend too much money on jeans. I admit, I don't like to spend too much money on jeans. I do not. I don't really think it's needed. You can spend a calm 40 bucks on jeans. I don't think I'd go that way. You can spend a calm 40 bucks on jeans. I think you're good. Um, these are gap. I mean, some Uniqlo compressions under this joint, so I'll freeze my balls off. Calm gloves from like Models. Being regular, being subtly fly at the same time. But I'm gonna check out what's up here. Walk up these stairs. I ain't gonna try to get the ladies on camera because it's kind of weird. Uh, it's a lot of walking. Um, probably think I'm putting this on camera. <laughs> um, this is Student Association. I guess that's a building dedicated to that, or it's part of another building. We'll see about that. Okay, the Theater Arts Building. That's my major, if y'all don't, y'all didn't know that. Um, Theater arts major, um, black studies minor. I always want, was into black studies, but a lot of schools that I went to prior, um, such as Mohawk Valley Community College, did not have that available. And in fact, I only took one black studies class out of all of my like 60 fucking classes I took. And, well, 60 credits I took. And it's just very enlightening. Not too sure what that is over there. You want to check that out? They got Starbucks on camp. Let me see if they got a job opening. <laughs> so, I'm going to go check out this building. Productions I'm actually going to be a part of um, in the future. So, starting in 
late January, late this month, early February. We got that. We have Town Tomorrow. We have Romeo and Juliet. Of course, by Shakespeare. And um, some more good stuff happened. Starbucks, cool, cool shit. You know, cool cat. Everybody's pretty chill. So, it's pretty cool. Ooh, that view is crazy. Let's go check out that view. So, that view is wild. Looks like a good biking lane. Um, so, Dork, Dorkski Museum, Kenneth Theater, Student Union. So, boom. I think that's under construction. That looks pretty fucking junky over there. Um. I think this is another res hall building. Um, we gonna go check out that gym. I think that's the gym because I see a giant NCAA banner. It's a cool ass tree. Um, this is like cool chill out spots. Like this is real calm over here. I like it. Um, get you a little scone and a coffee or scone and a, a green tea. And just have a ball. Um, that is a rest hall. Uh, caping hall, capping hall. Niggas be capping. I'm tired of niggas capping. I don't even know that's how that's, that's, how that's pronounced. But <laughs> no DMCA, no copyright. So this is the gym, if I'm not mistaken. Oh no, this is Student Union Building. Right next to the Student Union building is the atrium. Uh, it's pretty cool. Fun fact, I actually visited here in November of 2019, which is my senior semester at um, Mohawk Valley Community College. And the snack machine. Um, and honestly, it was, it was pretty cool. Um, I actually missed my tour guide and because of traffic and, you know, snow and New York state problems, um, it's pretty cool. I guess we won a championship in the year 2019, which is the year I graduated from MV and 2015, which was my junior year of high school. But toward the camp, with me and my brother, when my parents stayed in the car and all that good stuff. And it's pretty calm. Um, so, so a couple of things. I was given permission to go into buildings and just look at some stuff. Of course, not do anything crazy, but um, I looked through it before Corona. So, oh shoot, which way should we? I think we should go this way first. We're gonna go this way first. And it was pretty calm. Um, I found out that they have a radio station, which I'm super interested in. I found out that they have a newspaper, which I'm interested in. I found out that they have a TV station. I'm interested in that as well. They got all this cool shit. I'm like, y'all should might as well come here. But then I was interrupted by taking a trip to Atlanta and going to Morehouse College, which is, you know, a private institution private black college and that should cost fifty thousand dollars a year and i'm not paying for that so samuel Dor dorsky so this is like our building here i think i'm gonna go around um this is where the health screenings are um, I've been quarantining, you know, back at home in Brooklyn for the past two and a half weeks because I took a trip to New Mexico and um, that is on the opposite coast and that is not too far from LA and LA is like a hot zone right now for COVID um, and may God be with those people out in LA, you know, my Cali uh, uh, people 
you know, on my bay people, on my, um, you know, people down Long Beach and all that good stuff. Damn, it's a big ass campus. So, this is New Mexico and had to quarantine before coming to school and now I'm here. I have to do daily health screenings online and answer questions and stuff. I'm like, all right, dude, like, let me just do this shit, man. Like, get this shit out the way. And uh, now I'm here and I'm safe and sound. You know, the air is different. I think I'm a little higher in altitude compared to where I was in New York. Um, and I think I'm just getting crisp ass air. My nose feels really freaking this shit is sharp very sharp air this is a calm spot i think i'm gonna take a couple pictures here um that's the atrium the big ass glass building i wonder how long it took to build this thing i wonder how, and i also wonder how who's the architect behind this this is pretty fucking cool um, so, we have people in there, you know, a little front desk, I don't know if y'all can see, um, you know, people walking and cruising, so it's the administration building, it's pretty high. I guess you can see the view. Everything else. It's pretty high. What's up? I think I'm going to take some pictures of this. Definitely. Hey guys, what is going on? What is going on? That video was pretty dope. It was actually, you know, I thought I had things figured out all on camp, but I definitely did it. Um, <laughs> so whenever you are going to a college, no matter if it's a community college, no matter if it's PWI, no matter if you're studying abroad or um, a place of higher education, especially if you're moving in and you're not coming from, you know, a privileged background or you're not coming from, you know, money or you're not coming from seeing college campuses your whole life, uh, you know, between your older siblings and your cousins or your aunties, your uncles, whatever, if you're not used to that, Make sure that you good. That's the number one rule because for the next two years, you could be in harm's way. You could be in a, a, you know, a situation where you're in a, a state or a city that's affected by natural disasters or it's a high crime rate or it's a low crime rate or it's like a super like hippie town or something like that, um, such as this one. Um, and you could be on a campus where the culture is full with black and brown people and Latino people, um, and you know, Latina and Latino people, um, you know, you could be at a college predominantly female, like I am. Um, you could be a, at a college predominantly male, like I was about to go to, um, back in the fall. Uh, you, you know, you, there's many variations, but make sure that you good. When I was walking around on camp, I was like, oh shoot, they got a light. That's tight. Yo, they got a, they got benches and all this stuff. Feel me? We could throw a picnic, whatever. We could do whatever. Like shoot a music video. Like these are the things that you take into consideration because you're going to be living there. Not your mom, not your brother, not your sister, not your auntie, not your uncle, not your cousin, not your third uncle, not your third grand auntie twice removed. No, you're going to be experiencing this. Um, so make sure you take all that in co into consideration. But I'm feeling comfortable, slightly. I'm not feeling at home um, because I told you where I come from, but that don't mean I'm limited to that. So I'm coming to this campus with an open heart, open mind, open soul. Um, it's tough to you know be that vulnerable, and it's tough to you know deal with growing pains and just taking risk every every day, betting on yourself. Um, it's tough, but. Anything is possible, like my homie Kevin Garnett said. Anything is possible. Anything is possible. It really is. But I hope this video finds y'all well. This is one of many. 
This is a new age. It's a new renaissance. It's a new beginning. It is a new... Yo, it... it bruh. Make history. Make love. Not war. Peace. Love y'all world. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, all that good stuff. Peace. Love y'all.